You want to be politician? Be a good politician. Don't jadi jangan ada peribadi tau. Jangan ada kepentingan diri to be a politician. Politician is to serve the people. Genuinely. No kepentingan diri sekali-sekali pun. Anyway, they are paid. Wakil rakyat are paid. I am very fair. Even the present government, I said to them, shape up, back up, or get out. Same thing to them. Be good, be good politician. For the sake of the people. But don't start breaking up the people, instigate misunderstanding, fight here, fight there, pergaduhan. This is no good. And then besok you jump on one party, you jump to another party. Why can't we all live in harmony? If we all work together, help the government, this will be a trouble-free government. I cannot become a businessman. I'm, I'm not really a businessman. I'm not a, a, really a business. I don't go to office. I look after my own uh, plantation. I like oil palm. I'm a planter, and I've been looking after oil palm for the last 30 years. And I know my business. And it all belongs, it's not a listed company, belong to us, 100%. No, actually, it belongs to one person. Good income, good expenditure too. We have horses to look after. We have bills to look after. We have the motor pool to look after. Helicopters to look after. Airplane to look after. All from our income. Not from the government. I do have my bad luck. Not that I touch everything turn to gold. I wish. I've been con too. I make mistake. I make bad mistake. Um, I make the wrong deal sometimes, but I will somehow or other will recover. But I learn through my mistake. People always think that Johor are the super super rich. No, it's not. What well, we have enough is enough for us. A ruler have to live a life of a ruler. We have about between eighty to hundred and twenty thousand people that go through the CIQ every day and back. Very bad traffic congestion, not only on Johor side, but on Singapore side too. Both sides. Well, I don't have problem with Singapore government. I can always see them anytime. They can come see me anytime. I don't mind to be the mediator. It has to be a Johor that's decide with the blessing of the federal government. You must understand the Joe sentiment. I'm telling this also to Singapore. Whatever they want to do, propose to Joe, it has to be a win-win situation. You know, when you build that second link before, nobody wants to use the second link. Now, with Iskandar moving there, then people start using second link. Before, it was just a white elephant bridge. Even the, the CIQ there, it's all not been filled up. It's running only about 40%. And then you want to talk about a third bridge. I visited the Pengkabungan Orang Asli, Kawasan Pedalaman Kembara Makota for the second time, third time this time. I've seen the Orang Asli today. They're not much different between us. They're very pampered. They must be whatever they want, we give. They want school, we provide them school. We provide them with houses. We provide them with plantation. Some get six acres, some get 12 acres. Very manjur. Oh. We can't be doing that forever. They must. We, we provide them everything, school, everything. They must be educated. They must come out. But they don't change their tradition. But if you... If you don't do this to the Orang Asli, tell them they have to compete 
we will forever expecting the government to come and provide them with all the whatever facility they need. For how long? Joe is expanding. Jungle are getting less. You have to adjust your lifestyle to the changes. Logging is controlled by uh, Jabatan Hutang Negara. You cannot just simply cut log. There are log which has marked or dead, you can cut. But sometimes the contractor a little bit naughty, they will adjust the road a bit, they have to cut that tree down, which is not marked. So you are intruding outside of the Kawasan. We have uh, Jabatan Hutan Jo. They are always around. Forests are always around. And it's not easy to smuggle or sell timber from one area. It's not a small thing. You be carrying, you get stopped. Um, it's very much under control in Johor. Very, very much. Because Johor does not, not many timber area left. So it's well controlled, I think, in Johor. Waste water. You'll be running out of water. Poor government have to buy a water truck, tankers, send water to you. Be grateful to the government. Eh? See, the government send water to you. Now be grateful. But we have to be educated. Don't waste water. Police are doing a very good job. You can't expect the police have got their finger in every shop or every everywhere in your home. But the police are monitoring closely. And they come to me and report to me nearly all events what happened for the last one month. I've been working very closely with uh, Kutopoli Joe. We, we talk on the phone, I call him sometimes, he will report what's going on, everything. And uh, I'm working closely with the police. The police now is going to install a lot of uh, security cameras everywhere. Yeah, they, they are. Event that happen. But don't look down at Joe because of somebody get killed down the road. People get killed everywhere. Our police have got the best intelligent network. You tell me. Their job is to catch people. And they've got the best network in the country compared to others. I think this part of the world, I salute the man in blue. Of course, improvement never stops.